Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart Supreme Grind Burr Grinder. It's great, especially if you are a coffee lover. It's important to grind your beans right before you're brewing your coffee for the freshest, most flavorful cup. This product is really interesting because you can set it for anywhere from four to 18 cups by sliding the bar. And what happens is when you hit start, it will grind exactly the right amount of coffee that you need for your coffee maker. The other thing that's nice is it's a half pound hopper, which is removable, so is the lid. So you just pour your beans right in, put the lid on. And I should also mention this is the removable chamber that holds the ground beans. It holds up to enough coffee for 32 cups. You just choose your size and you hit the power bar. And today I'm just going to choose four. You hit start and it's automatically going to grind the exact amount of beans that you want. But something I should mention is that it goes from fine just by twisting this all the way to coarse. And fine is used for espresso and coarse would be used for things like French press. Today I'm going to put it on medium and I'm just going to hit start. And there you have it. And then all you do is you remove the chamber in the front here. You don't even have to remeasure your coffee. You just put it right into the filter and you'll have a beautiful, fresh and flavorful cup of coffee by using the burr grinder. Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, Director of Marketing Communications for Cuisinart. This is the Cuisinart Grind and Brew 12 cup coffee maker. If you lift up the lid right here, this is where the bean chamber is. This is where you put your whole beans. To make a full pot of coffee, you fill it to the top. To make less than a full pot, you do one tablespoon of whole beans for every cup that you're going to brew. This is where you put your filter. You just open this up. You put your little filter in after going through the process that we recommend soaking it. You put it right in there and that's perfect so you get perfect tasting coffee because it's going to filter your um, water for you. This is our on off button. This is also used for the auto off feature. You can program it to go off automatically after it's done brewing from zero minutes to four hours. Has a one to four cup function, has a grind off function just in case you run out of whole beans. And this is your hour button and your minute button, which you'll use to set your clock time and also for doing your programming. This is um, the program button. So if you want to program your coffee maker to go off at a certain time in the morning so that you wake up to fresh, flavorful coffee, that's what you're going to use to do that. This is where our um, filter basket is. In here, this is where you put your gold tone filter or paper filter if you're going to use it. Um, then you put the little lid on and you close it and that's where the um, ground beans go after they're, after you, they're ground by the machine. This is the um, glass carafe. It has a brew pause feature. It holds 12 cups of coffee. This is your keep warm plate. And on the side here, this is where your water window is. This tells you how much water you need to put in to make however many cups of coffee you want to make. So there you have it, the grind and brew Cuisinart coffee maker. Hi, I'm Mary Rogers. This is the Cuisinart Automatic Grind and Brew Coffee Maker. You can't get a fresher cup of coffee when you use this coffee maker. It has a grinding chamber where you put your beans and it has an integrated mechanism that then automatically grinds those beans and dispenses them into the filter basket. You really get the freshest, most flavorful coffee possible. It has a lot of other great features too. It has a clock right here. It has a one to four cup setting and that is special for making you know, uh, lesser cups of coffee because it adjusts the way that it's brewed so you still get a great flavor. It has an hour button, a minute button so you can use that to set your clock. 
has a grind off feature. So for any reason, if you run out of whole beans and you don't want to use the grinding mechanism, you can shut that off. It's totally programmable between, you know, for 24 hours in any given day. And it also has an auto off feature. So you can set it to automatically go off between zero minutes and four hours. This way you don't have to worry about forgetting to shut your coffee maker off. Let me show you some of the internal mechanisms. Right here, this is your bean chamber. This is where you're gonna put your whole beans. If you fill it right up to the rim here, that's exactly the amount of beans that you need to make a full pot of coffee. It's gonna put the lid back on, and you'll notice this is the chute. This is where the ground beans come out. You put that back in there. This is your um, water filter holder. We also give you a water filter, which um, you have to prepare, so follow the instructions in your manual. Generally, it includes soaking and rinsing the filter to activate it. And then you're going to open this up, put the filter in here, close it, and then just mount it inside the coffee maker. This is where your water goes. I'm just going to close the lid. Then I'm going to open this part here. This is where your filter basket is. And we give you a permanent filter to get started. This is reusable. Just dump your grounds, rinse it out, let it dry and you can use it over and over again. If you prefer to use paper filters, these, this coffee maker takes cupcake style filters. You just put it right in there and that's how you get started. We give you some to get you going. Just put that back in. This is the lid and you'll notice in the top of the lid there's a hole. This is where the ground beans get into your filter basket. That's how that happens. Just close this and there you have it. Here's your carafe. This is a 12 cup carafe. It has a really nice ergonomic handle, has a knuckle guard here so your fingers and knuckles never touch the hot glass. The other thing is it has a brew pause function so that if you need to sneak a cup because you're impatient and can't wait, you can do that during the brewing cycle and then just place it back in there and it'll keep on brewing. So there you have it, the 12 cup automatic grind and brew coffee maker. You can't possibly get a fresher cup of coffee.